So we're check. Hey guys, how we doing today? We're checking out this Ram 2500. I'm your Dodge dude, Mark Richardson, here at Heartland Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram. And this is one bad truck, as you can see here. So this thing is going to have your projection LED bulbs, the sensors on it up front here. You can see you got the Ram boxes on the back. And that's what we're going to go over in this video today. We're going to go over all these cool features on this truck. Now, just kind of do one little quick walk around. You can see that black ram color really popping out at you on your key fob for this big boy here you're going to have your tailgate drop you're going to have your remote start from the key fob there as well really nice ride the ram 2500 it's got the cummings turbo diesel cummings turbo diesel you got your ram box you have your bed extender here in the back so when you pop this open you're going to see you have this little guy there so I'll pop out here on the edge of the bed for you. Give you a little bit more room in the bed, which is nice. Throw that closed there. And you can see you have your power hookups down here. It's a four by four. Real nice vehicle there. Get a side shot on this side. You can see that right there. And then let's take a look down here at the suspension and all that. So this is what makes this thing the truck that it really is is the this has a C frame on it so you can see the frame here this frame on this thing is uh, super solid this is actually uh, all steel high strength steel enclosed frame on this one the 3500 is the cha cabin chassis those are gonna have a C frame this one has a full steel frame on it ready to go you got the skid plates underneath the bottom as well for you Checked in some of those major components on the engine. So that's what you're getting when you get that limited package. You're not only getting just get the stuff you can see on the top and the bottom, but you can get that stuff you see down here too. As you see, it's got your for your smoother ride in that cab there. Really nice setup. Got the 4x4. Let's pop her open here and uh, see what it's all about on the inside huh so we're going to get inside the truck here and as soon as we open that door up you're going to see those power running boards fold down for you the back seat in this thing nice lots of room tons of room you can just smell the quality of that full grain leather coming through as soon as you open that door up this is a really neat little deal here so this guy will actually fold down flat just like that so you can have some nice little storage space there pretty cool nice deal there and then you're going to see you have a uh, heated seats back here guys got a little led light in the back of the seat they really took trucks to the next level got some cup holders back here for your back passengers check this out this is super little cool thing i don't know what you know about this but this is actually designed, these two little slots here, they're designed to hold an iPad. Really neat stuff. This thing is designed for luxury and class in every single way. You got speakers in the ceiling. This is, has a uh, Alpine stereo system in it. Really nice sound and stereo system. You're gonna hear that thing and then you're gonna see your Alpine uh, subwoofer is right underneath this rear seat here. Got some storage on the other side. We'll cruise over there and take a look. And you got some storage underneath here, these little ram bins underneath there. Those have removable liners in them. Really nice. You can see that stitching they put in the door there with that smoked look. You can really see the French seam and the quality all the way through these trucks. Look at that big old speaker right there in the door. That's going to throw out some nice sound. If it's me, I'm listening to Snoop Dogg. I like the little gangster rap. I know you may like it too. Maybe it's not your thing. You can listen to a little country. But you'll have full control with your 12-inch Uconnect system here. Really clean. These are cool because they open and close like that. So you can either have it just be showing like this or just like that. This little center console here, and I lean little by no real means of the word. You can see this thing has a top tier felt lined, real smooth look. Got your USB port with your easy out crimp there. And then this whole piece will actually pop up for you guys. Really neat. 
so these guys thought of all the stuff you're going to need to be hauling a trailer. You pop that open, and then you can see down in here, you got all the old Ram trucks from back in the day. And this actually will pop up here, help prevent any of those items on emergency stops from flying forward. Pretty cool stuff. We slide this back, you press that little button there, that guy slides back for you. <clears throat> and you can see you have your Ram wireless charging station here. There's a light on the side that will actually uh, come on to be able to uh, see that your phone's charging for you. You got a little household plug down here. Uh, there's definitely a reason why the Ram Limited won a uh, luxury vehicle of the year. And you can see why here with the piping on the seat, all the detail all the way through. I'm really blown away by these trucks. Every time I get in one, I'm just super impressed with the level of uh, comfort and quality all the way through. So you do have two um, storage bins here, glove boxes. One on top, it's gonna be felt lined. And then you have this one on the bottom here as well, also felt lined. This 12 inch Uconnect system, when you take this truck home, you're gonna get your own manual just for that system to be able to learn how to use that thing. Really cool stuff. So let's go ahead and pop in on the other side and check this out here. So you got the tow, you got your uh, tow, your uh, your uh, jack armor up thingy. You got your tow hooks up front. See them lights? They just you know they're gonna put out a lot of light. I like that chrome look. Really nice truck. Love these trucks. Super cool. So we're hopping in the truck here couple of things on before we get inside here let's take a look so you can adjust your foot pedals that's very cool you can adjust the steering wheel up down in and out and you have your power button for the cargo right there so with the power button for the cargo that's actually going to be for your ram boxes here in the back so you pop these open and you're going to have a couple different things going on here so you have that power right there and then you have the light where you can turn those lights on and off from inside there, which is pretty cool. And then on the side of these things, you can just tell they have tons of room in here to be able to fit all sorts of cool stuff, right? Close that puppy down. And then let's go ahead and hop back here in the truck and take a look at the inside. So we get inside the truck here, and man, super comfortable seat. You can just really feel it wrap around your body. Awesome. Um, you know, let's get settled in. So some cool things here. You got the power folding mirror. So I'll press that button there and you can watch what happens. Truck's not on. Those still work. Those are power folding mirrors that go in and out just like that. Pretty cool. And uh, what's this top button you say? So you press that button right there and that actually allows you to adjust the outside um, mirror, which is neat. So that outside mirror you're going to be able to adjust that up and down. You can see that moving there. So that'll move for you. So you don't need to roll your window down to be able to adjust that. And then if you want to adjust the other mirror, you just turn that off. Turn that off by pressing that button again. And then you're able to go ahead and adjust the other mirror as well. Really cool. So VR, this is a really neat feature on these things. So once we fire this puppy up, turn the truck on, fires right up for us. It's nice beautiful spring day here in Excelsior Springs, Missouri. So this truck fires right up for us. Just press accept there on this feature. And so some really cool things. I'm kind of impressed when I, you know, they say you have a hands-free feature. What does that mean to you? So the VR is what that means to you. So I'm going to come in here and I'm going to say, I press this button here and I say, Turn cabin temperature to 70 degrees. Setting temperature to 70 degrees. Pretty cool, right? So you turn your temperature to 70 degrees. That can come in quite in handy if you're out there on the road, you know, you're in heavy traffic. And those minutes and seconds, they do count if you have to take your eyes off the road. So having uh, a safe way to be able to change your radio station, the temperature in the vehicle, and all those things right from that button there with using only your voice is crucial in my world. On the back of the steering wheel here, I know you can't see it. Let's go ahead and turn around here to see if you can see that right there so you do have a little uh button there that's for seeking on the radio so let's go to our um 
satellite radio here, folks. And let's listen to the music. Oh, Silk to Sonic. Let's see what's up with this. Oh, yeah, you know, you've been hearing that on the radio these days. Got the number one hits. You can change the station there by pressing that button that's on the back. Got the Soul Cycle. I think that's a good station to check out. Yeah, definitely some good music popping off today, if you know what I mean. Boom Dizzle. That's uh, not really sure what that means, but just throw that in there for you. Got the volume controls on the other side, just in case you want to crank that volume up. And this Alpine stereo system, it just pounds in here. This thing sounds so awesome. So, so awesome. Hey, I love this truck. So let me show you a little bit more about the ins and outs of this thing. I just, so you press this U apps button right here. Check this out. And then you're going to have travel link. Guys, this is going to show you fuel prices by brand, by distance, by price within 10 miles of your local area. You can have the weather maps coming on here so you'll be able to see what's going on with that weather and all that in your local area. Awesome stuff. And then I just can't, I'm just sitting here inside this cab. And I just love how quiet it is. You got this huge motor, the 6.7 Cummings turbo diesel motor in here. And this thing is just quiet. It sounds nice. It's super quiet inside the cab. It's amazing. It's amazing the how quiet it is in here. Let me go back here. Take a look at other stuff. So you have Sirius Satellite Radio, uh, XM Traffic. That's going to give you live traffic updates. You can remote start a diesel from your cell phone guys how cool is that you're gonna see you have driver heated and vented seats inside this vehicle scroll over to the right active go services super cool so you're gonna be able to be sitting in the comfort of your own home send some stuff to your vehicle hop in and you're hitting the road ready to roll here is gonna be a really neat deal this is going to show you all the operations of the vehicle so this is going to show us transmission uh, temperature oil temperature of the vehicle all that stuff so your accessory gauges I get super geeked out over all this super cool pitch and roll of the vehicle all that just shows you the current status right now we're three percent grade to the left um, altitude is 887 feet Pretty cool stuff, guys. I'm telling you what. Neat, neat, neat trucks. So you can actually even, too, switch this screen into two screens. Very cool. Back to one. This thing does have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto on it as well. You'll plug that in right there. So if you want to see what's going on with uh, two different things at once, maybe your cell phone and then the satellite radio with the other. It's whatever, uh, whatever fits your most desires. And one quick secret here for you guys. So I press settings and go into safety and driving assistance. This is going to show you all the features on you. any kind of uh, Fiat Chrysler automotive vehicle. will have a similar section where you can go in here. And it's almost like customizable. So you have the parking sensors on this one. You got your blind spot. Blind spot detection. This is automatically moves the blind spot uh, detection to the rear of your trailer. Really cool. All you got to do is hook up your trailer. Take a large turn to the left large turn to the right and then that's going to automatically move that uh, blind spot to the rear of that trailer power step if you don't want that thing coming open when you open the door you don't have to hill start assist tire fill assist the truck is going to honk at you when you get it filled to the correct uh, psi in your tires mirrors and wipers let's check this out so you do have the rain sensing wipers in here don't have to worry about turning them on in the middle of a storm I just love the ease of use with these vehicles. And you can just really see the quality and everything all the way through on these. You have the power sliding rear window. You got that control right up here. So you can do that right from there. You can drop your tailgate from up here. Really cool stuff. Back to the steering wheel, you can see that same design all the way through. You can really feel and see the quality all the way through this thing. It's amazing what you can do with these vehicles. And then here on the dash, so you can scroll through, you have these little arrows here, and you can see so much more. So you can see uh, commercial settings in here, you can see um, the PSI for the tires, you can see the radio setup, you can see uh, the miles per gallon inside the vehicle, you can see all that right here. The off-road pages is right here, there's the PSI for you coming through, the speedometer, um, all that stuff, really cool. Um, really, really, really cool. All the stuff that you can do inside here with this vehicle. 
Um, you do have an exhaust brake in this thing, tow haul mode, you have all these auxiliary switches, so this is automatically ready to go for plug and play, like for a rear camera for the end of your trailer and stuff like that. Um, tons of stuff to learn inside this thing. I just love, you know, the Alpine stereo system with this 12 inch deck and uh, you know the black all the way through with the leather seats and then the interior beautiful trucks they run great and there's definitely a reason why they've won awards over and over again if you have any questions about it once again this is mark richardson your dodge dude um hit hit me up and i'll be more than happy to go for a test drive or tell you more about some of the other really cool Mopar products we have here. Mopar stands for Motor Parts. This is Mark Richardson, your Dodge dude from Heartland Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram. Thanks for watching this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And you guys have a great day and stay safe out there.